guys, it's That Sweet Simmer, and welcome back to my channel for The Sims 3 All-in-One Let's Play Part 6. So, in the last part, it was kind of a chill part. We kind of just skill build -ed 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 -ed. Yeah, that is a word in my vocabulary. Okay. <laughs> oh, wow, that is la ha -ho -hood. Let me turn that down a tad. Wait, what? Did I change the age? Oh, oh, oh. My game is lagging. And again, I probably say this like every single part. Sorry if you hear my computer freaking out because, you know, I'm rendering a video in the background and recording at the same time. So it's kind of like, girl, what you doing? Chill out one thing at a time. <laughs> um, but yeah. Oh, that's why it was laggy because story progression was activating. Or it's because we live in an apartment, which is always a problem in my game. So, today is Saturday, which is, I guess, a chill day. Tiffany has work at 1, and Charles doesn't work at all. And we're probably going to invite over Latifa Because he wants to be closer with her, or best friends with her, or whatever. Um, but, yeah. <laughs> so she's just going to head off to work soon, in about an hour. And she needs to really work on her guitar skills, so I'm going to have her work on that until she goes to work because she's not doing that great. <laughs> so, yeah. And Charles is just, I guess, going to chill for now. I might turn the aging on to long um, for this Let's Play because they're already, like, she ages up in 15 days to become an adult and I don't know if I'm ready for that yet they haven't even like gotten married or anything or whatever is going to happen in the future but yeah anyways I have a green tea from Starbucks everyone thinks I am so weird I like my green tea unsweetened kinda just like iced green tea that's it like plain and simple um, but now we're going to invite Latifa over Slippy, slippy. <laughs> wink, wink to all my uh, Swamp family members here. <laughs> um, but he's going to invite Latifa over and we'll see if she wants to hang out a little bit because it is Saturday. Maybe we can go out or something. I don't know. It seems like funny or weird because I've said this a few times in the past that he hardly ever gets a wish for with something related to Tiffany, um, but he got a wish related to Latifa right away when they started talking, so I don't know, maybe there's some little bling brewing up there, I don't know, because, I don't know, he doesn't seem very serious about Tiffany, I feel like he's kind of, I don't know, <laughs> I feel like he's kind of not very serious about her, that's plain and simple. <laughs> um, but I'm going to have her work hard, I think, maybe? Oh, no, she doesn't need to work hard. Um, I'll just have her meet some musicians so that she can have some friends. I don't know. <laughs> Sorry if you hear my bird. Yeah, my bird is annoying. So I guess we'll just chill here with Mr. Charles Grooves while he cleans the counters and stuff. <laughs> but he also does need to work on his athletic, but he has tomorrow off as well. He only works three days a week. That's a little strange to me. I don't know. <laughs> and my video is done rendering, so you can hear my computer calmed down. It's like, all right, there's only one thing going on now. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> um, I guess he's just gonna chat with someone while he waits for uh, Latifa. Did she say she was coming over? I didn't even see. What error? What error? I guess we'll find out. I don't know. I don't see her right now. Girl, I thought you were coming over. Is she? I thought so, at least. Jeez. And he knows a lot of horses. Oh! I totally forgot we were going to get a cat. <laughs> Uh, now you can see that it's been a while since I have filmed this, but I totally forgot to look at what you guys actually wanted. But I will do that when Tiffany gets home. Alright, go ahead and call this girl again, because it apparently takes a lot to get her to get out of the house. I mean, 
She said sure, so she is coming. So I guess we'll just wait. I guess we'll wait. <laughs> um, just go chat with somebody. I guess you can meet some more people. I mean, why not? Um, but yeah, we'll just we'll just wait. Patiently wait in the quiet, quiet, quiet apartment. Wait for Latifa. Where is she at? Where is she at, though? Where are they at, though? Do, do. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm very hyper. It's been a while since I have filmed, so I need to get all my heebie-jabies out. Let's see if any cars are coming to us. Nope. <laughs> um, not that I can see... Oh, is that Latifa? Latifa! Is that Latifa? Yeah, it's Latifa. Oh, I guess she's married now. That's interesting. <laughs> she met Kim Creed. Who's Kim Creed? <laughs> That's funny. Um, Kim. 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 There she is. <laughs> she has some mustard looking hair. Alright, so we're gonna go buzz in Latifa. Oh no, no, uh, that's not what I wanted to do. That is not what I wanted to do. No, no, no. <laughs> um, we'll just chill here. Charles has received an invitation to Angelo Mendez's. That's so awkward. That's our ex's dad. Get off the computer. Be asked to move in? What in the world? What? Be asked to move in. This is... what? What is this bitch doing? Is she pregnant? I think she's pregnant. Charles and Latifah get along so well. Would Charles like to move in with Latifah? Their household funds would be combined, and Charles will have the option to bring along household members. No. What? Even? <laughs> that has never happened to me before. We'll ask her about her day, and he... Hmm. I don't know, she might be pregnant. Mm. Sorry. Dude, that's a little awkward. Salute. Okay. Ooh, that didn't do very well for their relationship. Mm. Nope. So we'll just talk a little bit more, and I th think we should try and be a little bit flirty with her and see what happens, because it, Charles just seems like that kind of guy. He seems like he has this brewing admiration for her, and I think he wants to test the waters a little bit. I mean, he is a young adult, and he did kind of hop into dating Tiffany pretty fast, so I don't know. I guess we will see. <laughs> we will see. Oh gosh, she took it, guys. She took it. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I mean, I guess that's what they want. I don't. This is very strange. Charles is such. A backstabber, my goodness. Oh my god. He is such a cheater, and I'm pretty sure she is pregnant, so... She's a cheater, too. <laughs> um, I don't even... Wow. Ask to break up with Martin. I don't know. She, see, they're flirting, and he's getting these wants for her. He never had that with Tiffany. He never had a desire for Tiffany. Like, in any sort of way. I mean, yeah, they're dating, but, like... Oh, Tiffany's off of work. I guess she might come home and see this. I don't know. He... It has slipped his mind that... It has slipped his mind that Tiffany is off of work at 6 o'clock. So, I guess we will see. We will see what happens if he notices that she's coming home, or what. The time totally slipped his mind, and he's not thinking about it at all. We're gonna do a first kiss. 
my goodness, he is such a cheater. Oh my gosh. What a backstabber. I guess we'll see what happens if we ask her to break up with Martin. Is she pregnant? I can't even tell. I know that I have a custom content thing that allows you to wear that outfit while you're pregnant. I don't know. You know, you're right. Things are over between me and Martin. Martin might be pretty upset with you, though. This boy is a little bit of a player. I mean, not even a little bit, a lot of it. <gasps> Does she even, like, notice? She doesn't even notice. Oh. She noticed. She noticed. <laughs> Sims are starting to catch on that something between Charles and Latifa. They might want to tone it down. Aww. Be accused of cheating. <gasps> accused of cheating. Oh my goodness. She noticed. She noticed. Now what? I need to get a picture of this. <laughs> the drama is starting. She is like, how could you do this to me? I brought you in to get you out of your ex-wife's house. Oh my gosh. So she has three days until she... Until she decides, I guess. <gasps> that jerk! He is such a jerk! Oh. I was gonna wait until... I was gonna wait until... The three days, but... We're gonna go insult her. Who do you think you are coming into our house, or my apartment? That lying, cheating child of a motherless llama, Tiffany Wilson, will never forget exposing a low life portrayal. And he's just off to fucking bed. Like, oh, sorry. I did not mean to say that. I'm <laughs> sorry. We're gonna fight her. We're gonna literally fight her, which she'll probably win because she's in the military, but we're gonna still fight her. Like, who do you think you are coming into our house? And getting with my boyfriend. We're gonna ask her to leave. Poor Tiffany! <laughs> she was so young and so naive. She just picked the wrong guy. And a lot of you guys knew it. A lot of you guys commented telling me that. He wasn't serious about her and that he was probably gonna cheat. So we're gonna fight. We're gonna fight. <laughs> That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna freaking fight him. You're gonna just stand there and watch us? Really? After what you just did? I don't know. You guys let me know. Should I wait out the three days and see what she decides? Or should we just end things with him? Go ahead and comment that down below. Because I think... She's really... She's really upset. And he, if, even after she saw them and she interrupted it and yelled at him and accused him of cheating, he went over and hugged Latifa. He didn't even care that she was there. So maybe they should just break up. Maybe that is just a telltale sign that he is not good for her. Tiffany is a great girl and doesn't deserve that. And he doesn't deserve her. Huh? Worry about relationship. Oh, please. You're so worried about your relationship, but you cheated on her. You cheated on her. We're gonna yell at him. He's trying to turn it around and make it seem like it's her fault. You weren't there. You didn't do enough for me. All that stuff. 
All that cheater crap. <laughs> She's just like, a talk to the hand. We're gonna go. We're gonna leave and maybe go stay at Jared's house. Where does Jared live? Jared. <laughs> Jared. What's his last name again? Hamilton. Jared. 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 He's not home. Is he home? We're gonna go visit the Hamilton household. She is out of here. She is done. She... Her mind is so full and her heart just hurts. This is the guy that she brought in to save from his crazy wife. <laughs> but I guess he did cheat on his wife for her. And we all know that saying, once a cheater, always a cheater. Or, if he'll cheat for you, he'll cheat on you. These are our life lessons. Wank, wank. <laughs> so she's just going to head over to Jared's. She's going to pour her heart out to him. And maybe he'll let us stay over for the night while she decides on what she wants to do with this. You know, this is her first real relationship. She She's not very experienced. Of course, she takes his car. You know, I would too. <laughs> um, she doesn't know. She, He is engaged. I didn't know he was engaged. We're going to have to end that. He is our best friend, and I don't think she wants any girl getting in the way of that. She wants to be the only girl in his life, and I already know. Who's this? Piggy Hamilton? Is it a little puppy? Oh, how cute! I guess Jared has a dog. That's cute. Alright, so we're just waiting here. She's so upset. Poor girl. Did, did he let you in? No, call Jared. Call Jared. She wants to be mean to Latifah. I mean, if we see her again, I'm sure we will. Come on, Jared. Come home. She's just sitting here endlessly trying to get him to call. He's not home. Well, we're going to make him come home. <laughs> does she work tomorrow? No, she does not work today. Or I guess, yeah, today. So, I think what we're gonna do... Are we near any sort of food place? Not really. I guess we're gonna go to the bar across the street. We'll visit the Golden Rose. And drink our sorrows away. <laughs> Poor girl. Maybe we will invite him, invite Jared to the Golden Rose. Alright, so we are here. We're going to call Jared and ask if he wants to come. <laughs> to the Golden Rose. And hopefully he says yes, hopefully he's not with Nina. Do we know Nina? <laughs> no. Don't you think it's a little late to talk? Jared! <laughs> Rude. Um, we're gonna go order some food because she is a little bit hungry. I guess we'll order the shrimp cocktail and all that stuff. And Charles is just at home asleep. Like, what a cold-hearted person. Like, to be able to sleep after doing such a terrible thing. Poor, poor girl. Is just here. Who's this? Oh, I guess it's a guy from the dating website or whatever. She, she's just so hurt. My poor Tiffany. She's like, get me a drink. <laughs> I'll have six, please. <laughs> just kidding. She's eating. Right. And of course, to eat shrimp with none other than a fork. <laughs> Closing time. Well, let us finish our food. We paid freaking seventy-five dollars for that. Bye. Oh my gosh, so terrible. All right. Well, now she's hungry. <laughs> Aww. Poor Tiffany. 
is the diner open? Open 24 hours, so we're gonna go eat here alone. What a great, great night. <laughs> and she'll probably end up spending the night on a bench because she does not at all want to go home and see Charles. At all. Alright, let's go. Go a little faster, sweet he. Sweet pea? I meant sweet pea. I said sweet heat. <laughs> Gotta take a sip of the Starbucks. Okay, so she's just gonna head to the diner, get a little bite to eat because she is very hungry, and probably just sleep outside the diner, to be honest. Or something, find a bench somewhere. Alright, she's gonna go in there and eat. Alright guys, so I'm going to go ahead and end this part here. My game is acting up a little bit and acting like it's going to crash. So, yeah. This part has been pretty heartbreaking, eventful, and, you know, heartbreaking. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, go ahead and leave your comments down below telling me what we should do. Should we just end things all together with Charles without even giving him a chance? Or should we let her wait it out and decide herself? I love you all so, so much. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this part, give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already and you'd like to be. And I'll see you all in my next video. Bye, guys.